welcome back to my channel. It's Monday the 27th of December and it's my first day back calorie counting after the Christmas break um, and I'm really looking forward to getting back healthy eating because I feel really really sluggish and a bit yucky so I'm really looking forward to that. Um, thanks for joining me if you're new my name is Joanne and I'm calorie counting using the app NutriCheck and yeah so this is the first day back after Christmas I've got a weigh-in update that should be up now so if you haven't already checked that out perhaps you would like to go and see how how I've done and yeah so anyway I'm gonna get my breakfast and I'll show you shortly what I'm having this is my breakfast so I've got 40 grams of all bran which I've just soaked in boiling water and that is 134 calories and I've topped it with 120 grams of the Aldi, Aldi's 0% Greek yogurt for 74 calories, 100 grams of frozen weight raspberries for 26 calories, and I've got 200 mils of oat milk measured for the day for 96 calories. This is my lunch today. It's a total of 258 calories. So I've got 26 grams of um, these LD Speciality Crackers for 116 calories. And on there I've got 35 grams of Brie for 102 calories. 20 grams of Cranberry Sauce for 30 calories. And 10 calories for the tomatoes. So I'm having this as a pudding. I've got 85 grams of Satsuma for 35 calories. And I've got coconut kavag and that is 85 calories. My lunch was very nice but it didn't fill me up very good so I'm hoping this will help. This is my tea tonight. It's a total of 346 calories. So I've got 100 grams of McCain Naked Crinkle Chips for 168 calories. 100 grams of turkey for 153 calories. And it's 23 calories worth of um, salad there. And I'm also going to put some 30% less um, fat salad cream. I've got to weigh that. So I'll put that on the screen. Um, and I'm putting a spray of this on my chips to try for the first time. I'm pretty sure I saw somebody say it's zero calorie. I need to check that, but I'll let you know on the screen. Whoops, so yeah, that is my tea tonight, and I'm absolutely starving and can't wait. So that's my first day done, and I've thoroughly enjoyed being back on plan. Um, because, you know, by this time now of an evening, I've been feeling so yucky and sluggish from eating all the rubbishy food so it was really nice to be back on it I mean when I went to bed last night I was quite looking forward to waking up this morning and starting on it again uh, so yeah so I'm just like wiping the slate clean and this is a fresh start um, my weighing update is up so if you haven't already gone to see that it'd be great if you could go and check it out um, so yeah, so I had, you know, I thoroughly enjoyed my Christmas, um, but now it's, that's it now, got to crack on and lose this weight. Obviously I've got more to lose now than I had before. Um, I've retaken my, uh, calorie calculator. Now I follow, um, a lady on YouTube and she's so lovely she is called Louise's Journey XO. Um, she's done really, really well. I can't remember how much weight she's lost, but, you know, a tremendous amount of weight. And she's really into her gym and she's like doing weight training. I think she's in competition soon. So she, she just, she inspired me so much. She's, and she's so dedicated. Anyway, she recommends doing James Smith's calculator um, because I have read, I've noticed a few people saying that NutriCheck seem to like put everyone's more or less on 1400 and quite often it can be a, 
sometimes they put the calories on too high for what you should be having. So I done I done a couple of um, calorie counters, and then I done Jane Smith, and they were all coming out sort of around the same numbers. So it came in that I should be on one thousand three hundred and eighty three. Obviously now with my new weight because I've gained. Um, so yeah, so that's what I'm on now, 1,383. And I've also decided not to set way days an easier day because um, if you've been watching me a while, you'll know that I do quite enjoy having that set as an easier day so I can have um, some extra treats. But I'm going to not do that now for at least a month and see how I go to just have the calories that I'm set without messing around with them. Um, there's obviously still some rubbishy food left in the house. Um, there's still some of my favourites, which are Lindt and Fer Ferrara Rocher. But so far, today I've resisted them. And I think when you come in with a new mindset and you're determined, you, I think you can resist things. Um, so I'm hoping I'll be okay, but if I have to co incorporate some in my calories, I will. That is a good thing about calorie counting, you can do that. But obviously, you don't want to be eating your calories, um, you don't want to be like spending your calories on junk, really. It's better to eat the be the healthiest stuff, really. So, so yeah, um, and also my husband has signed up for NutriCheck now. Now he has done it before and he hasn't um, continued with it. He's like done it for a short time and got complacent with it and just didn't bother. But this time he's quite determined I think and he's hoping that 2022 will be his year that he'll lose the weight. So it will make it easier having him um, following it with me as well. So so yeah, so obviously I've got a little bit more to lose now than I initially did before Christmas. But I am determined. Um, I'm hoping that I can get a good chunk of the the gain off this week if I can. I have got, I've got like today, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, it's all on plan. And then Friday, New Year's Eve, we've got a buffet. So there are going to be some things there that aren't going to be quite within my calories I would imagine um, so that's Friday and then I've obviously got Saturday and Sunday before weigh day so I'm hoping I can I can get some kind of a chunk out of this game um, lost so that that's what I'm hoping for um, so yeah so I've really enjoyed everything I've eaten today my tea was absolutely delicious I've had a coffee at my dad's now if you are new to my channel I go to my dad's probably every other night and he's 86 and he enjoys making his coffees um I've I've um like I really enjoy them and when I tried give giving WW a go a few weeks ago I stopped having his coffee because I couldn't fit it into the points which is absolutely ridiculous and I don't intend doing that you know if I want this then I'll work it into my calories because, you know, it's 35 calories for two teaspoons of coffee, mate. And then I never have sugar at home, but there I have sugar. Um, today I didn't. No, I didn't have sugar today. Beg your pardon. I had some sweeteners in my bag and I was very good and I had sweetener instead of sugar. But usually that's like another 16 calories, I think, of sugar. So that was good and today I've had a Tunnock's tea cake which I didn't film which was, tell a lie, I had two Tunnock's tea cakes, I did, 210 calories and I've also got my whip in for now, all through this Christmas um, since you know while I've, whilst I've not been videoing I have not had a skinny whip and do you know what I have missed them I love my skinny whip so I'm really looking forward to sitting down later catching up on some YouTube and eating my skinny whip god I'm sad but 
that's what I'm looking forward to. So I've got my skinny whip down um, and I'm over by eight calories today, which for my first day back, I don't find too bad. So I'm on 1,407. So yeah, eight calories over. If I hadn't have had that second tea cake, I would have been okay. But it's done. So I don't regret anything. I've had a really lovely um, Christmas and I've enjoyed it with the family. So that's the main thing. And now the line's drawn and I'm back on it. So yeah, and I'm feeling so much better already. And it's only like being, what, 12 hours? Um, but yeah, I feel so much better. And I even feel less bloated. Whether it's all in my mind, I don't know. But it's definitely feeling better. So I'll just quickly show you my screen. Of course, I've got this black screen now and it's reflecting back. So my breakfast was 330, my lunch 378, and my tea 346, and then my snacks 353. So I'm ending on, come on, 1383. Ignore the exercise because it's not linked in. So yeah, I think it's been a good day. So I'm going to go now and get this edited so it can get up and go and enjoy my skinny whip in a bit. So thank you so much for watching. And if you haven't already um, gone over and watched my weighing update, I hope you've all had a lovely Christmas and you're, you have stayed safe and well with this terrible pandemic, whatever, what's going on. Um, so yeah, and I'm so glad to be back, back here doing this and I will catch you all again tomorrow. So thank you very much. Bye.